Hello, I'm Yukaria Oluchumwaichi. I'm a Nigerian working as an academic at the University of Port Harcourt. Here, my research focuses on environmental assessment, monitoring, and cleanup technologies. So, I'm more interested in biological technologies that are environmentally friendly and also cheaper in comparison to other available methods like the chemical methods or the physical methods. Yeah, this research policy in communication workshop appealed to me because in my work I do science communication. So I train a lot of people. I every day have a burden of sharing my work with policy makers, with colleagues, with non-scientists. I go to media, radio, um, television, and also in print. I try to push out my work, my content. I also use the social media to talk about my work. So it was very exciting to see the content of this workshop capturing my need. So I jumped onto it, applied, and I was invited. So it's really very interesting, and I think the, it's meeting the expectations so far. Yeah, having been in this workshop for four days now, um, I take away how to apply more of infographics um, and maximize images in my communication and also to focus on my audience. Yes, we've been doing audience baggage in different kinds of communication uh, we do, but really thinking about my audience being uh, policy makers is really different. So we've been fighting hard how to bring down the language to the layman level because a few days ago we had interaction with the policy makers and I asked that question, what is it that you find so annoying about scientists? And he told me, we use technical jargon that they don't seem to understand and we are overconfident. So now I am beginning to rethink and we've been doing projects with our work here in this workshop, how to address the problems in the society that we're working on using our research to the policy makers. So bringing down my language to the layman, to the policy makers, to the man on the street. Because by and large, the research we're doing is focusing on, you know, solving societal problems. So we need to make the problems known and then what, what um, provisions that we have made with our research so that the, the people who use the research will understand and people who make policies and who implement them will also understand both the problems side by side, the solution that we are providing. 